Hey everyone, how you guys doing? My name is Chef DeAndre Carter. Um, I'm with Soul and Smoke here in Evanston, and today we're gonna be doing a demo of shrimp and grits. Um, so we're gonna start off with the shrimp first. Um, we're gonna add a tablespoon of garlic oil to the pan. I like to add a little butter in there as well, so we add probably like a half a tablespoon of butter. Get up in there, bro. All right, there you go. Put a little bit of butter milk. Yeah, the shrimp next. The shrimp we have marinated with our Cajun rub, a little bit of garlic powder, uh, black pepper, a little bit of salt. Uh, we let the shrimp marinate overnight so you can have a nice flavor on the shrimp whenever you guys do get a chance to try the shrimp and uh, Next, we're going to work on the andouille bear. A little bit more oil here. We're going to add the andouille sausage. And then we're going to add some of the holy trailer. So one of my favorite things about shrimp and grits, I love the flavor of it. Um, it's a nice spice pour from the Andouille sausage. It's homey, it's confident. It's everything that'll make you really feel good uh, if you enjoy a nice bowl of food. So I want to check on the shrimp. You can see they starting to kind of like grind and like wash the edges right here. You can see that it's almost ready to be flipped. So I'm gonna check this one right now. There you go. Pretty much ready. We're gonna flip these over. And then once we flip them over, we're gonna turn the pan off. Kind of just let them carry over from the uh, actual cheese that's on the pan. Um, meanwhile, we're gonna go back to the Andouille bed. Uh, right now, what we wanna do is kind of like form a, form a roux. And this is, this is what's going to um, thicken the sauce. So we go about two tablespoons of all-purpose flour. You're gonna get your spatula and kind of like mix that all in. So it looks like if the flour starts to coat, you know, the vegetables and the sauce, what you're gonna do is add a little bit more fat to it. You wanna kind of, it should look like a runny, almost like a runny floury sauce. You want to let that cook into the roux, which is the flour and the oil starts to get a little bit brown. Um, and then once that gets brown, you want to add your chicken stock. And then I like to add more Cajun flavor to it. So I'm going to take a, about a, a tablespoon of Cajun spice a little bit more black pepper, and a little bit of salt. And you just wanna grab your whisk. I like using a whisk because sometimes the roux sticks to the bottom of the pan, and you need something, you know, really strong to kind of like loosen it up. So at this point right now, you just pretty much just wanna let it cook on down till it starts to become thick like the sauce. And then once it becomes thick like the sauce, it'll look something like this. So I have one already made for you. Um, and then we go plate it up. So we go start out with the grits. We have the creamy stone ground grits that I get from South Carolina. We about two tablespoons of that. And then I like to add my shrimp next. So you can put the shrimp right on top of the grits. I like everything to have a little bit of that sauce love. So we're gonna stack those up like that. And then we'll come with the Antulli best last. So you just need about a, um, a nice, it's about three ounce ladle. Just put that right on top. 
And then we garnish with the classic green onion. So I like the white and the green part, kind of like giving it a nice onion punch. So I like to really mix those in. And there you go, folks. Here's the shrimp and grits from Soul and Smoke. Hope you enjoy it.